Usual interstitial pneumonia is a form of lung disease characterized by progressive scarring of both lungs. The scarring involves the supporting framework of the lung. UIP is thus classified as a form of interstitial lung disease. The term usual refers to the fact that UIP is the most common form of interstitial fibrosis. Pneumonia indicates lung abnormality, which includes fibrosis and inflammation. The term previously used for UIP in the British literature is cryptogenic fibrosing alveolitis, a term that has fallen out of favor since the basic underlying pathology is now thought to be fibrosis, not inflammation. Causes The cause of the scarring in UIP may be known or unknown. Since the medical term for conditions of unknown cause is idiopathic, the clinical term for UIP of unknown cause is idiopathic pulmonary fibrosis. Examples of known causes of UIP include systemic sclerosis scleroderma, rheumatoid arthritis, asbestosis, and chronic nitrofurantoin intoxicity. Symptoms The typical symptoms of UIP are progressive shortness of breath and cough for a period of months. In some patients, UIP is diagnosed only when a more acute disease supervenes and brings the patient to medical attention. Diagnosis UIP may be diagnosed by a radiologist using computed tomography scan of the chest, or by a pathologist using tissue obtained by a lung biopsy. Radiologically, the main feature required for a confident diagnosis of UIP is honeycomb change in the periphery and the lower portions of the lungs. The histologic hallmarks of UIP, as seen in lung tissue under a microscope by a pathologist, are interstitial fibrosis in a patchwork pattern, honeycomb change and fibroblast foci. Pathological findings in usual interstitial pneumonia. Differential diagnosis. The differential diagnosis includes other types of lung disease that cause similar symptoms and show similar abnormalities on chest radiographs. Some of these diseases cause fibrosis, scarring or honeycomb change. The most common considerations include, chronic hypersensitivity pneumonitis, nonspecific interstitial pneumonia, sarcoidosis, pulmonary langur and cell histiocytosis, asbestosis. Prognosis, regardless of etiology, UIP is relentlessly progressive, usually leading to respiratory failure and death. Some patients do well for a prolonged period of time, but then deteriorate rapidly because of a superimposed acute illness. The outlook for long-term survival is poor. In most studies, the median survival is three to four years. Patients with UIP in the setting of rheumatoid arthritis have a slightly better prognosis than UIP without a known cause. History, UIP, as a term, first appeared in the pathology literature. It was coined by Beryl Abraham Lebo. See also, pneumoconiosis, silicosis, asbestosis, idiopathic pulmonary fibrosis, pulmonary fibrosis. References External links, Coalition for Pulmonary Fibrosis, Pulmonary Fibrosis Patient Services, Education. Funding Research to Find a Cure for PF, coalitionforp.org. PIPF. The Pennsylvania Idiopathic Pulmonary Fibrosis State Registry at University of Pittsburgh